Hi everybody. I'm Lian Duan. Today we are going to talk about how to create your first Helm chart. The topics I'm going to through in these videos are create chart directory, create Kubernetes resource in chart, verify chart. Before I go to today's topic, let's review what is chart. Helm uses a packaging format called a chart. A chart is a collection of files that describe set of Kubernetes resources. A single chart may be used to deploy something simple like MMD cache pod or something complex like a full web app stack, which HTTP server, database, cached, and API server. First topic, create a chart directory. Command is helm create plus chart name. Based on helm best practice, the chart name should be all lowercase. My demo chart name is my minor app minor config. Open terminal and log into my Linux box. Run command helm create my app config. Did you to create successfully? Go through each subfolder and file. Charts, a directory contain chart dependence. If my chart defines dependencies and Helm depends update command is called, my chart dependent file will download to the charts folder. Next, chart.yaml file includes chart metadata information. Templates folder. All my Kubernetes resource file store in the templates folder. There are eight files are in templates folder. All files created by Helm create command. Deployment file. The file content is a Kubernetes deployment resource. Helps.tpl file. Predefined Helm function will store in the file. HPA.yaml file used to save auto scaling information based on the Kubernetes metrics server. Ingress.yaml file, ingress resource definition in the file. Notes.txe file. The content show when you run Helm install command. Service account.yaml file. Kubernetes RBAC information will defined in the service account.yaml file. All service resource defined in the service.yaml file. Test subfolder has the test minor connection.yaml file. The file used to create a pod and then run a command when the pod running to verify my chart. All default value for chart template in the values.yaml file. Next topic, create a Kubernetes resource in chart. Delete all the files under the templates folder since my chart is a simple resource. In the future class, I'll show how to use each pre-created template file. Use rm minor rf start to delete all the files. Before run the command, please use pwd to verify your current folder because it's a dangerous command in the Linux world. My charts only has the simple resource. My app config.yaml file. Use a vi command to create my app config.yaml file. The YAML file used to create my config map resource. 
The name is my app config. The key value pair is key is username, value is Lian. If you are not familiar with the Kubernetes config map, please click below link to go to my previous class to get detail. File created. Back to parent folder. This is the topic for today, verify chart. The command is helm lint plus chart name. Verify successfully. Today we learned use helm create command to generate a chart directory and then create a Kubernetes resource in the chart. Latest verify chart use the helm lint command. Thanks you for watching the video. I hope it was help and it was. Do not forget to like it. If you want to be notified whenever a new video comes out, then subscribe my channel. If you have any questions or something was not clear in the video, please post them in the comment section below and I'll try to answer. Thank you and see you in the next video.